Hello everyone. In this lesson on Mozart and the Modern Bow, we will be looking at the life and works of Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. Mozart was one of the most influential composers of the classical era. In his short life, he wrote more than 600 works. Mozart was born and raised in Salzburg, Austria. His father, Leopold Mozart, was a skilled violinist and teacher who taught his son and daughter to play piano and violin at a very young age. Leopold toured Europe with his children to show off their talent to princes, kings, and queens in exchange for gifts and money. During his travels, the young Mozart met and learned from other accomplished composers, and he heard great music from a variety of countries. Mozart's exposure to the best music of Europe was an important part of his education. He began composing at the age of six, and during his childhood Mozart wrote eight operas, 21 symphonies, and many other works. When he was too old to earn money as a child prodigy, Mozart got a job as a court musician in his father's orchestra in Salzburg, and he continued writing symphonies, sonatas, chamber music, and other choral works. He wrote all five of his violin concertos in the span of just nine months when he was 19. As his works gained popularity, Mozart went out on his own to look for better work in Mannheim, Munich, and Paris. Mozart spent so much time away from Salzburg that he was eventually fired from his Salzburg job. This embarrassed Mozart's father. After they had a serious falling out, Mozart left Salzburg and moved to Vienna, Austria. There, Mozart met and married Constanze Weber when he was 26, and they had six children, but only two survived infancy. In 1784, Mozart became friends with Haydn. They played quartets together, and Mozart dedicated six string quartets to the elder composer. Though they were friends, they specialized in different musical genres. Haydn was the father of the symphony and the string quartet while Mozart composed 41 symphonies and many other works for chamber music, his unusual ability to write moving, sophisticated melodies naturally contributed to his advancements in both opera and the concerto. Mozart wrote 22 operas, and his 23 piano concertos helped popularize the genre. His many wind concertos, particularly for oboe, clarinet, bassoon, and French horn, remain among the most important concertos for those instruments today. In the last five years of his life, Mozart was extremely productive, writing his last symphonies and many of his most famous operas, including The Marriage of Figaro, Don Giovanni, and The Magic Flute. While he made good money, it wasn't enough to support his lavish lifestyle. His financial struggles worsened and his health declined. At the end of his life, he began writing his Requiem, which he did not finish before dying at the age of 35. Now read this lesson in your workbook and answer the questions in the study guide to review the unit. My name is Christopher Selby. Thank you for watching this tutorial on music theory for the successful string musician.